what's up guys it's the girl and welcome back to my channel guys if you're new to my channel welcome 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 if you haven't subscribed to my channel as yet click that subscription button right down below and turn on that notification bell so that you can be notified anytime i upload a new video in today's video we are out here in belize city we're going to be trying different foods if you guys know me you guys know that i love to eat so today my friend and i mickey we're going to test out these different foods and we're going to tell you guys what we think hello guys i am mickey i also have a youtube channel and on my channel i share my experience of the places that i am working which at the moment is belize in central america so if you want to experience the places that i am working or you want to know how to experience these places please consider subscribing check me out i'm sure aunt is going to leave my link in the video description somehow and normally what i say is my name is mickey keep, keep watching, watching. on Hyde's Lane. We are testing foods. Um, I love to eat. How about you? I'm just looking forward to this. Testing some Belizean food and stuff like that. Um, I've left my stomach empty so that I can fill it up with some nice Belizean del delicacies. Yeah. So yeah, let's let's go and, and, and test it. Our first stop is meat pies. Have meat you ever pies. tried it? I am a Ghanaian in africa from africa west africa right and i've realized that there are a lot of food that belizeans eat that has got some correlation with african food as well okay. so that is one thing i'm looking forward to to see the link we have with the caribbean so we also have meat pies right mm -hmm. but it look like what you call is it patties patties mm -hmm. yes so the patties what you call patties we call it meat pie okay and it's the same shape it's the same shape as the patties Okay, but we okay. call it meat pie. So I am, you know, looking forward to try what Belizeans call meat pie. All right, I'm let's looking do forward it. to that. Let's do it. So we're currently in the line, guys. We're waiting for our meat pie. The line is a little long, but we're ready to try, yes. you know. Yes, um, I've got all the patience for food, yes, especially for Belizean food. So yeah, good things come to those who wait. That's so right. I'm happy to wait. Let's do it. After like about a half an hour, wait, that was a half an hour, right? And more than a half an hour. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, we finally got our meat pies. Um, they have a few people there waiting for the meat pie, and they were very, um, what do we call the word, um, like you know, I want this pie, so I'm gonna stay in the life of this it. pie. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. yes, we got it. The pie is one dollar and 25 cents for one. I'm very hungry, and I'm looking forward to this pie. I am because um, we waited, as I said, very long. Mm -hmm. This pie must be good. <laughs> I think it is. Yeah, because I think it a is. lot of people persisted and they stayed. Mm -hmm. yeah, so let's, let's, let's try. Let's, so at a glance, this guy looks like cupcake. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I think they bake it in a cupcake sheet. So oh, like, okay. The pan. That's what I'm doing. Ooh. Yeah, this is my one time. <laughs> yes, it's very hot. Yeah. You know, I like, I know why they call it pie, right? Because at a glance, it's got the pastry. That mm -hmm. the Ghanaian pie, the pasties and um, pastry, okay. So it's just the same as meat pie but um, shaped in a different so patties, yeah. Some people eat it like by opening it, mm -hmm. you know, some just bite it. For me, I'm just gonna bite it. It's very hot, so, so it you is have hot. to be careful. So I'm just going to open it <laughs> just to be on a safer side. Well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna bite You're going to I'm bite. bite. I can't take you to the hospital, you know. Mm, see? <laughs> That's cool. Okay. Inside is very juicy. What is inside? It's like um, a curry. Have you ever tried curry? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Curry chicken, you think? I don't know, but mm. it gives me that vibe. For real? Like Indian type of curry. Mm, it tastes to me like, 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 almost like a stewish like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm, not it, I'm not tasting the yeah. curry. I'm not getting it. Yeah, lucky. Okay. Yeah, it's very, very nice. Juicy though. Very juicy. I'm just taking it like oyster. 
oyster. You know when people take oyster and they, mm -hmm, they suck it out. <laughs> Very nice. So it's got minced meat in it, right? Mm -hmm. But that's why they call it meat pie. Okay. Meat pie. But the dough itself has like a biscuit, like mm. a biscuit taste. Oh, yeah. Like like yeah. a. I'm not sure like how to explain it, but it has this taste. It's it's kind of sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit of um, sweet, like... but I don't know. Is the sweetness coming from the, the flour? Mm -hmm. It's flour, right? Yes, yeah, flour. Yeah. So I think maybe it's, from it's coming from that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's very nice, though. Really, really nice. It is. I'm enjoying this so much. This is going to go with a can of soda. I don't know. It might not be healthy to you, but. <laughs> I would say, like, a red, a red Fanta would be. Mm -hmm. I love red Fanta. For me, it's orange. Orange, okay. That's that's a plus. Orange. Yeah. This with that will be good. Sorry if you are like healthy, but you can treat yourself to one of these, and you can go and run it off. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. We find a lot of people buying this meat pie. Okay. They say this is the nicest or it's the best. Mm. And I I do like this one more than the others. I know something about it just gave me that want to come back type of vibe. <laughs> well, if you saw. The amount of people do mm -hmm. it, then you will know that there's no need to be told that this place does really good pie. Mm -hmm. And oh, this is amazing, it very is. nice. Um, I was tempted to get more, but we need to taste other food, so <laughs> yeah, I need some. With this space, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. my stomach. I'm impressed. Overall. I'm enjoying this, yeah. With all, I don't know if it's because I'm hungry. So this one hit the spot so much that <laughs> I actually want to go and go and get more. I know. So I'll give it eight. Eight? Ten. Mm -hmm. Alright, eight out of ten. For me, I think I'm gonna give it a ten out of ten. Mm -hmm. I, I love it. I mean, mm -hmm. the, the the season is just right. Overall, this is my favorite yeah. spot to come and you know. I was going to give it ten out of ten, but in this world nothing is perfect. That's <laughs> so. true. That's true. Mm -hmm. but I'm giving it ten yeah. out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> so whilst we were waiting, they have the seaweed. Seaweed is it seaweed drink? Seaweed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Seaweed. And it's got peanuts in it. And cinnamon. And cinnamon. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you know what else? Has it got no, he just has seaweed sugar. and cinnamon. Okay. Um, I guess sugar. Yeah, yeah sugar as well. And, and milk? probably milk, yeah. Mm -hmm. Milk. So we decided, you know what, we'll try that and wash it, wash our pie down with it. Let's see how it goes see down. How this goes. I, I never knew about seaweed drink until I came to Belize, so I'm going to give this to Belizeans. If you know where it came from, maybe from other Caribbean countries, please put it in the comment section. Yes, let, let us know. Let us know. Mm. Refreshing. If it was colder. Yeah. Seaweed isn't my thing that mm. much, right? But okay. it's, it's, it's good. Um, I like the peanut taste. Mm -hmm. And it's you know it's not it's not too bad. Yeah, it's very very refreshing. Mm -hmm. And I must say, guys, I love supporting my locals. Um, mm -hmm. You know, people who are grinding honestly. Um, they're not stealing. They're not you know doing mm -hmm. stuff. This guy was actually on his little bike. Yeah, little bike. And he was passing us, and he just you know anyone wants seaweed mm -hmm. and so forth. So we made sure to so, you yes. know support him. Yeah. I believe in supporting yeah. so anyone who is. Grinding. Yeah. So like, if you are on the streets of mm -hmm. Belize City, Ladyville, wherever in Belize, and you see this, when you grab it, it will be very cold and mm -hmm. it's amazing, it's very refreshing and it's very healthy as well. It is healthy, know? right. Yeah, but Belizeans <laughs> always say something. Mm -hmm. Belizeans always say something. Seaweed will make you make a lot of babies, so you have to be careful. Ooh. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We are not doctors. I'm just saying. <laughs> Well, if you want to make babies, <laughs> get your seaweed drink. How would you rate it? How much? Um, mm. I'll go for seven. All because I've tasted other seaweed. I think they had more milk in it. And because it was a bit more thick. Okay. For some reason, I'm used to the thick ones. Mm -hmm. For some reason, I'm, I'm used to the thick ones. So yeah, seven for me. So you give it a seven. For me... I'm not a seaweed person, as I said, but I do drink it. Um, I love the peanuts, but I'll go for a six. Mm. A six out of ten. Mm. Yeah. And then it's not cold now because we're waiting in the line that so long. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I'm going to give it a six out of ten. Yeah. But, but it's still nice. It's still, it's really still good. Nice. All right, guys. 
so we are at our second stop. We are about to get some burritos. Burritos, yeah. And um, let's see how it tastes. Let's see how it tastes, yeah. Y'all ready? After three and a half years, burritos. For the first time. Let's <laughs> do it. For the first time. <laughs> So we got our burrito. It's not like um, the ones that I'm used to, okay. you know, because usually they have like the coleslaw okay. and it's wet and stuff. So it's flour tortilla, uh -huh. coleslaw, chicken, cheese, a little bit of ketchup, and I think beans. Enough talking, let's start eating. Let's start, <laughs> let's say it. Be beans in it. Oh, it has coleslaw yeah. Coleslaw in it, yeah. Yeah. All right. All right, this is going straight into my mouth. <laughs> One thing I like is the tortilla. It's not crusty. I like it that way. It's got this stretchy sound to it. It's a sound, stretchy feel, <laughs> feel. texture mm -hmm. to it. I like it that way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like it has like a like a. I don't, I don't know. If, I'm not sure if I should say like a rubbery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, you stretchy, know, yeah. stretchy. Yeah. But it's nice. It's like when you're chewing meat and it's like a bit chewy, but that is what a good. Tortilla mm -hmm. feels like. Mm -hmm. And I feel a lot of flavor going on. There's a lot of flavor going on. You've got cheese in it. Mm -hmm. And this yellow thing, is that? That's meat. That's meat, right? Oh, that's pretty. Mm. I'm not sure how to feel about it, to be honest. I'm loving it. It's, it's, it, has a nice, it has a nice flavor. Mm -hmm. But I think for me, just a little too salty. I'm not too much about like a salt mm -hmm. person. When it comes to salt, everyone has... You, you give salt and and chili. It depends on the person, mm -hmm. what, how, what they are used to. Um, some people will eat something and they'll go like, oh, it's hot, it's spicy, and some people are like, what are you talking about? So I think salt is like that. Um, I should be one of those people who don't eat a lot of salt, but for some reason I don't feel like there's even salt in there. So you don't feel like I'm the just, salt? Yeah, I'm just enjoying what? it. What? <laughs> Alright, well I definitely taste the salt. Mm. But I mean if you're a salt person, I guess as you said, you know, you're not gonna think, you know. Mm. It's good though. Really nice. And this is located on um, Albert Street. Mm. You know, just straight down. You're gonna see um, the shop right there on the corner. So if you're in Belize and you wanna try these foods that we're trying here, guys, check them out. Let us know what you guys think when you guys come here. How are you going to rate it? So I'll give it, um, I'll give it a seven. Seven. Mm. A seven out of ten. I think I'll go with, I'll go with eight because this has really hit the spot. <laughs> I've enjoyed it. Um, it's good. I want to eat the rest but not on camera <laughs> because I want to devour it. That's how much I've enjoyed it. So yeah, um, it's a really good food that Belizeans have got. Mm -hmm. On the outside, you think it's all about rice and beans, right? Rice and beans. Mm -hmm. There's more to it. I always say like once you come to Belize, you are going to like um, find a lot of people coming to these type of shops. Mm. They want to get um, gacho, they want to get panades, mm. they want to get tabutes, they want to get great dogs and burritos, you know, just stuff like that. Being here in Belize, it's different from just seeing us yes. out there, yeah. I would yeah. say. Very true. You know, yeah. it's totally different. You have a, like, we're more into the these type of fast food yes. life. You know, of course so, we're gonna cook on a Sunday so, and stuff, but so like if you are a tourist and you come to Belize, it's sometimes nice to maybe pick a a, a week where you you go like a local. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't just don't think about the fancy restaurants and stuff like that on the beach. Just mm -hmm. come to downtown and then taste some of these things, and you will never regret it. I've enjoyed this food. Excited, are you excited? I am excited because one good thing about this one is um, Belize, if you've not realized, it's like a cocktail nation. When I say cocktail, it's so diverse with different like yeah. Spanish, we've got America, we've got Mexico, like all over the place. So, yeah. this is taking us into the Spanish roots mm -hmm. of um, Belize. So, I'm looking forward to that. 
it's the right. diverse. So this one is the garnaches, guys. So basically it has beans on top of it, cheese and ketchup. That's all, with a little bit of onion sauce. All right, on top of... Um... That is the corn, right? Oh, okay. This one is the corn, the other one is the corn. Yeah. Right. So with this, I, I'm in Belize, but eating this, I think I will have a moment in some Spanish island or something like that. <laughs> So yeah, this is more. Of, this is this is more of a Spanish food. Spanish food. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is Spanish food. But this is something, as I said, a lot of Belizeans come out here to get these type of food. Yeah. So let's have right, it. Let's see. <laughs> mm. So being Spanish mm -hmm. background, it's all about flavor, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's all about like kicking flavor. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Was that onion? Yeah, that that's onion. Top. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm trying to think of any African food. I say Africa, I can only talk about Ghanaian food. I spent some time in Kenya and the tortilla, the flat tortilla one, what was it called again? Um, burrito? The burritos. They have something like that in Kenya. I don't know if it's chapati. I think it's chapati, but then again, Flat tortilla is like common, isn't it? Yeah, it's really common. So it's what is in it that makes it unique. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. When you get to the onion bit of it, it gives you a different types of flavor. Mm -hmm. So I was worried that onion, like, but the onion makes it. It makes it really nice. Mm -hmm. And also, these are like these are the type of chips that we use for like chips and dips. If you guys know about Belize and chips and dips, that's what we use to make the the chips. You just fry it and you get your chips and dips what i usually do is i would buy the corn masa well the corn itself cut it up to how i want it um leave it to dry a little then fry it oh okay then it comes out this crispy and nice so is that the same chips that they use in doritos have you tried doritos you know i'm not too sure if it's the same chip, but maybe because it's corn yeah it's corn it is corn so we, i'm not too sure maybe yeah. who knows it's nice though it's mm -hmm. nice. there are so many different types of snacks and food over here mm -hmm. it's so amazing like you go around I've not really gone to a place where I pay attention to the food what I love about Belize mm. we are unique in our own way yep. of course as I was saying to you like you have different food that you could get so you could never get too tired of this one thing mm -hmm. You could always try something. Yeah. You know, there's a papusas, there's the you know garnachas that's yep. we're eating right yep. now, the burritos, the fried cakes, the you know there's so many things to and try. And we've not even we've not even spoken about the barbecues. Mm -hmm. And the tamales. We tried getting some tamales, guys, but they were all finished. Yeah, they were all finished. Um, I was looking forward to tamales, but yes. Um, and also maybe next time. Too. Is a oh, nice dokono, one, yeah, yeah, yeah. Too, but, it know. would have been nice to get some dokono because. In Ghana, we have kenke. We also call it dokono. Mm -hmm. And but if you're a Ghanaian watching right now, right, dokono tastes like edibi. It, there is another food that we eat in Ghana, and it tastes just like that. Mm -hmm. And it's amazing. Okay. On a scale of one to ten, how much do you eat the garnachas? I would go eight. Eight. Before I was like, I, I hope this tastes good, but I can eat this. Yeah, I can. Eat this. Yeah. I would give it an. taste was there yeah you know it was well seasoned um at first i was looking at it i was like ah this doesn't look like it's you know yeah. but it's good so i'll give it another sub 10. so now we're gonna try the um salbutes now this is corn masa with cabbage um tomato chicken on the top of it mm. so it's a bit different but it's the same corn yeah, this one has got some greens on it so it's always good healthy so i'm happy to eat my what did they call it? Um, your... I don't remember. <laughs> I forgot too! Mm -mm. The green is pepper. It needs or it's got pepper. It has. It has. The green thing is pepper. Mm. Um, has it got any meat in it? No? No. Yes, it does. Look. It does, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But like it's threaded, threaded meat. Mm. Oh, all the greens are gone. I'm not 
a vegetable person. Mm. So they know me. They know I don't like them, so they are falling off. Well, what do you think about it so far? Different? Mm -hmm. I don't think it's my thing. Okay. It's nice. But it's not yours? Really thing? nice, but um, I would like it with a drink. Okay. Yeah. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. So, you rate it as? I think it's because it's full of um, vegetables. Mm. I'm not a raw vegetable person. Mm. Me too. So I'm going to go for six. I'm giving it an eight. Mm. I think it's good. Well seasoned. Um, this was for 125 mm -hmm. And the other one was like three for a dollar or two for a dollar. Oh, okay. So the panad, the garnaches was two for a dollar. This one, which is the salbutes, is one twenty five for one. I know other places have it like a little bigger, mm. but it was still good. And I'm not sure if I mentioned where we were at, but we are at the BTL Park, guys. So they have different vendors here. You guys get to eat and you know do what you know. Come for ice cream. Come and chill. There's so many things to do here. Honestly, so many things to do mm. here. And that was it. I'm now full because this is the last one we're eating, right? The, the last of, of about four or five food that we've mm -hmm. tasted. Mm -hmm. So maybe it's because I'm full. Because it tastes really good. Mm -hmm. It tastes good. It is good. It is yeah. good. And if you had this with soda or something like that, I think amazing. Or a glass of water. Stay yeah. hydrated. It's hot that outside. That is. It's really <laughs> hot. I've really enjoyed today. Yes, thank you so much for being on my channel. No, thank you for having me. I and I've, you so I've much. loved it. Everyone who is watching Anton's vlog, amazing videos. If you are looking to come to Belize, if you want to know about Belize and more, because at the moment she's done more about Grenada and some yeah. of um, Caribbean island and stuff. And I know this is not going to be her, her last. So please subscribe and give her some support. Really nice lady. Thank you. Oh, yeah, thank, thank you. Very you. Much. That's so sweet. Well, guys, I'm going to wrap up this video right here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, if you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you haven't subscribed to my channel as yet, click that subscription button right down below and turn on that notification bell so that you could be notified anytime I upload a new video. Remember, guys, to check out his channel. I'm going to leave the link in the description box down below. Make sure you support him, guys. His videos are amazing. He has a great personality, I must say. So you guys are going to enjoy his videos. So make sure you subscribe. And as I always say, I always remember to stay true to yourself because there's no one in this world that is better than you. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. You gotta do the dance. To tell a friend. To tell a friend. To tell a friend. That's Anto say to tell a friend to subscribe to her channel. Until next time, guys. Peace.